everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jessica and today I have my weekly makeup basket for my basket babes. If you hear really heavy breathing, my puppy's right over there. He's kind of sleeping, snoring, so you might hear him. All right, let's get into this. A lot of it is going to be um, the same stuff. I have made a few minor changes, but uh, I, I'm kind of at that point right now where I am really trying to stay focused and get stuff done. That's what I got to do right now. It is crunch time. It is crunch time, people. There is not much time left in this year. It is disappearing quickly, and I need to get stuff done. So, without further ado, my primer is the number set number seven Lift and Luminate primer. Thankfully, that one does not have to be done by the end of the year, but um, it's the only one I'm working on, so it's in here. I have um, my Franken Foundation. Uh, this one definitely has to be done by the end of the year. Has to be. This one's supposed to be. I'm not sure it's going to be, but this is the NYX Lavender Color Corrector. And, of course, I have the Catrice Anti-Red Color Corrector. I have been using both of those pretty much every time I do my makeup lately, and they're working well for me. But um, I just don't, I don't know if they're going to get done this year. Can you tell my, my throat's getting a little bit scratchy? Really worried about getting sick. I'm praying that doesn't happen, but we shall see. Um, all right, powders. I have both of the same powders that I had last time. They're both Essence. This is the All About Matte Fixing Powder, and this is the My Skin Perfector Loose Fixing Powder. Um, I like this one when I first do my makeup, the loose one, because it does have some color to it. And then if I get oily, I like to go in with this one because it definitely... It tames the oilies a little bit. I, I could actually use a touch up right now because I'm, I'm feeling a little bit like 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 a little bit of a grease ball here. Um, that's what happens when you you're baking bread and stuff like that. All that heat from the oven, it just psh, it's like an oil slick. All right, let's get into the blush. Um, I have this um, one from Coastal Scents. It is the duo. I've got like a warm and a cool color here, so that's kind of suiting my purposes right now and I made a Franken bronzer it is still a little bit dark because I literally just made it but um, yeah that's what that looks like so that is the bronzer that I'm going to be using for this week it is uh, crunch time people you're going to see a lot of Frankens I swear you are because there are certain things that I need done by the end of this year and if I have to Franken them together so that I can multitask them that's what I'm going to do. I have so much of everything that it doesn't even matter if I multitask things because, um, yeah, there, there's too much of everything. So I don't have to feel bad about using too much of one thing or another. As long as it's got to get done, it's going to get done. All right. Um, let's get into, let's get the lip stuff out of the way. Um, the standard stuff, I have the e.l.f. lip lock pencil that I've been using on my eyebrows. It's kind of nice because it's very waxy and, um, it, it definitely holds down the eyebrow hairs um, so I can put like an eyebrow powder on and then I use the gel over top. It's working very nicely for me. All right, this is the Urban Decay Vice Special Effects in Regulate. I've got one lip gloss in and then lipsticks. Um, the one is kind of borderline between the two. This is Buxom Alexa. This is the borderline one. This is the Maybelline Color Drama and Strip Down. It's somewhere between like a gloss and a liquid lipstick that doesn't fully set. So yeah, I, I like it. My goal is to finish that very, very soon. I don't think I can do it in this basket, but I want it done this month, if at all possible. Um, the Problem Child, which I do have on my lips today. This is Buxom Wine Me Liquid Lipstick. I swear it multiplies overnight because I've had the stopper out of that for months and it just keeps going. Um, and then I have the Avon Rich Spice that I've been using as um, a cream blush. All right, let's get the eye stuff taken care of. First is my Essence, what is this? The Lash Princess Sculpted Volume Mascara. Like This is one of my favorite mascaras and my brain is just not engaged today. Um, I do like this. Um, I do feel like it's on its way out though. So I don't I don't know if it's gonna be done this week, but I do feel like it's gonna be done this month. The Essence Lash and Brow Gel Mascara, definitely not gonna be done this week. Definitely not, but it's getting there. It's totally getting there. For my eye primer, it's the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. That's just gonna be in there till it's done. 
Um, I've got these three liners from ColourPop. You can see all of my marks on those for my monthly updates. This one, I like, I did not use this at all last week. This is the Kat Von D Trooper or Tattoo Liner in Trooper Black. I've got Pacifica Gunmetal and this, this little tiny thing, like it falls in. That's my Amethyst Gem Pencil from Starlux. It is in there. I can still get it out. It does come out. I'm really hoping it's done this week. It is so close and it's, it's like this little nub. I really want that one done. And then of course I have my purple eyeshadow stick from e.l.f. Just going to keep working on that bad boy. I've got three cream shadows, kind of creamish. This, I have two Jelly Much. I have No Rest for the Vivid and On the Fly. Both of those are obviously color pops since they're Jelly Much. And then I have the City Color White Gold Eyeshadow Mousse. Love that one. Anyone surprised that I have my Pan That Palette in here? No, it's been in here every single week. <laughs> I don't think I've taken a week off yet. If I have, it might have been one week. So yeah, my BH Cosmetics Carly Bible Original Palette. Really trying hard to get that done this month. I don't know if it's gonna happen, but I'm gonna try. I'm gonna definitely try. And that leaves me with my Magnetic Palette. This guy right here. Um, royalty from Morphe Jaclyn Hill Palette. This is Bare Minerals. Coastal Scents Hot Pot. All of these are Coastal Scents Hot Pots. This is um, from the Too Faced Chocolate Bonbons Palette. One, two, three, four. Those are from the Coastal Scents 88 Palette. Palooza from the ColourPop Uh -huh Honey Palette. It is a glitter. And then this lonely little guy up here. Um, he looks like the rest, but he's not. This one's from the Sephora Colorista Palette. So let's see what I can do with these for this week. I am going to say my primary focus is definitely going to be on my BH Cosmetics Palette. That is what I have on my eyes today. There's not much left, but it's got to get done. It has got to get done. I actually did some repressing today, which is a good thing. And... Um, I pressed some other stuff in there that's not from this palette, but because there's so many empty pans in there, I was able to press um, like a highlighter in there. I have a second, like an extra blush in there. A few um, eyeshadows. Yeah, I've got stuff in here to play with to help kind of coordinate with what is left in there, like legitimately left in there. That is it for this. Um, makeup basket. My brain is fried. It is so fried today. I think I might be getting sick. So that could be why my brain has not been super functional lately. But I'm going to wrap this up. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until I see you in my next video, have a beautiful day.